Oh, hello, 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 and welcome to another inciting installment of A Little Dangerous Benign with me, your host and co-pilot, Commander Jack Little. Hello, sailor. Ah, and curtains. Welcome, welcome. Ooh, what have we here? New paint job. New paint job in the old asp. What gives? What gives? And this is definitely not where I left it. No, sir. Hmm. If only there was a clue. If only there was a clue into why. Why my asp is... appears to be on some sort of... some sort of planet. I must say, though, that's looking very dapper, isn't it? Very pretty. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh! There's a note. There's a note here. Hang on. Let me have a look. Oh, let me see. Hi, Jack. That's me. Sorry for hijacking your asp, but the weapons needed re-rationalizing. It does like long words, as any of the gimp. Also, I've hooked chat up to Commander Burkat's resource pot. I think we should try it out with some resource missions. Yours faithfully, the gimp. Oh. Hello, Ditopia. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Oh, materials still. No, not materials. I'm very well, thank you, Ditopia. I've had a, a lovely, relaxing uh, relaxing weekend in the sun, scaring the neighbours. And, um, uh, yes, uh, we're, going to, we're going to bring it off handsomely with, uh, hopefully, with some, uh, with some, with some streamy fun, yeah. Ah, M. Curtains writes, Please tell the gimp that he missed an apostrophe. Looks like spam. Ooh, sorry if I tell you. Oh, you're quite right, yes. Percats should have a possessive, possessive apostrophe. Naughty, naughty gimp. I shall put him across my knee. Uh, I won't, of course. Well, we don't condone corporal punishment here at A Little Dangerous Benign with me, your host and co-pilot Jack Little. No, sir. Right, well, um, well, let's get rid of this, first of all. Gene Bellow, welcome. Millstone, welcome. Oh, right. So, let's see. Chatbot, there we go. That's not the chatbot, Jack. Where is the chatbot? There we go. Okay, so, I think this is right. It's been a while since I've used it. There we go. Bye bye Jack's message. Bye bye the Gimp's message. Gimp apostrophe S. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha. Right. So let's get uh, let's get into our cockpit, shall we? And see where we are. Ooh. Well, we appear to be in Folna on A1. Falling under the Delta Squadron. I would uh, I would go for a drive, but uh, we have no SRV, so uh, let's just take off, shall we? Yeah. Ooh, actually, um, sound. Can I have a little bit more? Can I have a little bit more sound in the cans, please. Thank you. Yeah. Let's um, get the landing gear off. That's always a help. Let's see what's what. So we're going to do some uh, resource missions with this here, this here thing of perkouts. Yes. Now he's left me some instructions here. Oh, okay. It all seems straightforward. Hmm. Let's see what let's see what jobs we can pick up at Pats Patsayev City. Ooh, hopefully not reading jobs. <laughs> yes. So yes, um i I can't remember if I said before. I think I did, but uh, that nice Mr. Orange Spark, um he won some community paint packs in the uh in the Lavecon raffle and he rather kindly donated them to the stream. So, uh, 
Hence the, what I think is the Gamescom uh, paint job. Percat, welcome to the stream. Percat, of course, the uh, the engineer of the lovely, lovely uh, bot we're going to be playing with. In fact, playing with bots, don't we? Uh, yes. So what, um, as I understand it, what Percat's uh, bot does, and I'm sure he'll be happy to leap in and correct me, but um, it will give one the um, nearest location of a particular resource, uh, a particular product, I should say, really. Um, so if one needed coffee, one would uh, one would type into chat basically one's current system and um, one's uh, required commodity. That's the word I was looking for, commodity. And uh, and it would give us the nearest system and relevant station. So we're going to test that out by doing some uh, some of those shoppingy missions you get. Go. Oh, that was that was a pregnant pause, wasn't it? Twins as well, by the size of it. <laughs> yes. Certainly, ma'am. Uh, one of my favourites. The old uh, the old flight commanders. Flight, flight controllers, I should say. Yes. So, oh, he's had a look at me weapons as well, as as uh, as Gimpy. So, my. Two thousand meters from touchdown. We're just going to come to a full stop, are we? Well, there you are. Oh. No nope, brakes aren't very good on this. Dearie me. <laughs> I think Millstone Barn there is uh, referring to um, an XKCD cartoon in which uh, a parent receives an angry phone call from, uh, from the school because uh, he or she um, has named their child Exclamation mark, semicolon, drop table. Um, Landing successful. Yeah. So, uh, basically, it's just crashed the database, you see. Whoa. Refuel. Missions. Right. So, here's the plan. What there is of it. We're going looking for not boom data deliveries, not of those. Source and return missions. Preferably not wing ones though. Um, tempting as they are. Uh, oh dear. We're not actually in a wing. Very kind of you to offer. <laughs> uh, I think I think one must. Uh, I don't know. Why I'm helping you out. Uh, I think one must address the bot directly. Uh, that's that's a, that's frustrating. Lots of courier jobs. Honey wing. Sizable wing missions. Hmm. We have a. Oh, what have we got? That's the bunny. 72. We've got Olympic we can sell. <laughs> oh dear. Right. Didn't fall over. Not sure if I do sanitize input. <laughs> oh, Percat. 
this is going to be a rocky ride. <laughs> uh, but, you know, I think at this stage, one wants to break it in some respects, don't one? Doesn't one? Mm. Mm. What am I doing? Uh, advanced maintenance. Restock. Under control. Confirm. There we are. So is there another station we can try? It's quite a large system. This is, um, I think, over a billion in population. Let's try Faris or Beitel. That's how I'm saying it tonight. Or Beitel. Ooh, yes, I've... Um, Okay, it's only a little rocky. It's it. Oh, so uh, but yes, this is the try to break it phase. And curtains, that phase never ends well. Certainly for some things. But um I don't want to I don't want to downplay how marvellous this thing is, but uh, I would say it runs a it, you know. I think I think we can make it bulletproof, can't we? We, that's the elective we perk at. <laughs> uh. See, wheels, right. Boost, boost, boost. Now, while we while we fly over here, I thought it'd be rather fun to discuss a moment of um. Yeah. Oh, well, well caught, hem curtains. Well caught. I'm not sure servers come in bulletproof here. Bulletproof here and say, oh yes, well. But theoretically, you could wrap one in Kevlar. <laughs> yes. I suppose a um, uh, a shotgun would constitute a DDoS in that uh, <laughs> in that scenario. <clears throat> Yes, no, um, I was at the supermarket with Gimp uh, earlier today, and uh, we're, we're, we're trying out some new recipes, you see, this week, and uh, one of them is uh, involves pomegranate seeds. So the recipe listed under ingredients pomegranate seeds, as it, as it should. And uh, so we find ourselves at the local supermarket, and we can't find these pomegranate seeds anywhere. We've looked in, um, we've looked in dried fruits, we've looked in uh, baking, we've looked all over the place, and uh, uh, couldn't find them anywhere. And then suddenly, it occurred to uh, to me that the probably where we would find pomegranate seeds is inside a pomegranate. So we went to the went to the grocery section, bought a pomegranate. Job done. The imp looked at me. He said, "He said, um, but how many seeds did you get in these? You know." <laughs> and it's like it's all. It's basically all seeds. I'm not sure he's ever seen inside a pomegranate. So anyway, that's my that's my anecdote of the day. Ah. You get pomegranate seeds from pomegranates. Wisdom. Right. We approach Faris Orbital. I've been trying out a new voice as well, which I might I might keep my power to try on. I sort of it's sort of um It's basically James Mason, but with the dial I would say the dial turned down a notch, but um, actually, I think that one tends, in the grand scheme of things, to to go in a little bit hard on James Mason. Whoosh! That was fun. Uh, thank you, M Curtains. Uh, 
Titopia writes, yes, fruit has seeds in them. Yes, yes, indeed. Uh, and then Curtains, that's the funniest pomegranate anecdote he's heard this year. Oh, well, thank you. I know there's a... There's a... Quite a strong field this year. I'm sure I... I'm sure I pipped somebody to the post. <laughs> I just pipped, you see. Pipped to the post. Ah. Uh, uh. Shrikey, baby. Do come in. Pop yourself down. Have a tizer. Uh. Oh, the Shrike's been streaming, hasn't he? I wonder if we can... I wonder if we can give the Shrike a, uh, a shout-out. Can we do that? That's the thing, isn't it? And Ditopia, remind me, you, you stream, don't you? Lancor, Juliet, Alpha, Charlie, please comply with all regulatory protocols before commencing docking procedures, Commander. Ooh, she's a little more terse than the, uh... Permission granted. Land on designated pad number 37. Previous controller, wasn't she? Oh. But, you know, whatever gets you through the day, I suppose, is... So yes, no, um, people come in a little hard on, uh... Ah. Lovely, lovely. Ooh, Ditopia is streaming tomorrow, so he definitely gets a shout-out. Hurrah. I do like shout-outs, you know, because it's, it's about reciprocation, as much as anything, isn't it? And us humans, us real humans, you know, That's what we, uh... That's what we live for, really. The grand scheme of things. Scan detected. So yes, James Mason. People have a tendency to overdo it, I think. And I thought, you know, let's underdo it, see what happens. I'm quite I'm quite taken with it. Whoa. Yesterday. Well, the shrike, shrike, there's always a tomorrow. There's always a tomorrow. Let's see how we fare here. Mission, 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 mission. Luck be a lady tonight. Oh dear. Nope. Ah, there we are. We've got one. Hurrah. So, what have we got? Try that for 73k. Oh, that, that'll be a uh, mining though, mightn't it? Ah, performance enhancers. That'll do me. Yes, sir. Oh. No, Shrikey, it doesn't work, I'm afraid. It's um, it's mods only, that one. I, I might, I might... I might make it open to all because why not? You know, I know lots of uh, lots of streamers do that. So let's have a look. Oh, I should have done that. There we go. So it's at Ed underscore commodity underscore bot, and we want what do we want? Oh, I've forgotten now. Oh, personal weapons. Was it? Our performance enhancers, of course it was. Ah. No comma there. Oh, I see, yes. Oh, this is fun. Lovely typing here. You'll see this appear before um, before you hear me say it. And that's not where we're at. So we are at Folnar. Yeah. Don't check me tipping. Parfait, c'est parfait. Bon, ce soir je suis une typiste. Ah. So there we go. Off it goes. Jack Little writes Ed Commodity Bot. My records contain a system close to Fulner selling performance enhancers. The Okupinok system is 20 light years away. Can be found at the following stations. Bonda platform. So, 
Let's have a look now. Oh, the shrike missed me. He missed me. Right, copy nook. More typing. Yep, that'll do. But we did not jump because you were not there. Oh. Now, what was the, uh, what was that station? It was a platform, wasn't it? So it's going to be an outpost. I think Bonda. Nope. There's more over here. Panic not. Oh, okay. It's got a large landing pad, so it's going to be one of these, Jack. Think it through, man. the old-fashioned way. Ah, there you are. Just planetary. Spark, Freckly, and Curtains, and you were... Oh, so it was, it was very much a... Um, Ship is released. Regulate your speed until free of station perimeter. Very much a pool party reunion. Oops. Let's keep to the greens, Jack. Consideration. Oh. That's one of the things I need to add in. Add, in fact, that it tells you whether it's planetary or not. Oh yes, especially for you know, um, finicky people like me, what like to uh, navigate straight to the um, straight to the station from the from the galaxy map. engine, I think. There we are. Ooh, three, to, three to weapons. Sorry, commodity and then system. But that's a nice test there of searching for non non existing uh, commodities. I'll, I'll give you that. Although, um. I wonder if a switcheroo would be would be possible. Perkat did um, uh, did create the bot, yes. And um, it's I think currently uh, currently only available through uh, the through Twitch, uh, but will soon be be coming to other other things. In fact, can we get um, M, M curtains? Can we get a shout out for the for the bot? Because um, as I understand it, one can one can go onto that channel, and uh, there you go. Yes, one can go to that channel and type in at info to get some more information about it.
a time indeed. Well, Shrike, one has to be one has to be on the uh, Ed Commodity Bot uh, channel to request the info. Oops, I'm coming in far too hard. Let's pirouette for a little while. Get there in the end, Shrikey. Bondar platform sounds very Australian, doesn't it? <laughs> this is descending into IRC, writes M. Curtains. Gosh, we'll be exchanging ASLs in a moment. Zero five over there. Although I rather wish I'd uh, brought my distance glasses. Uh, um, Forty-three, um, RB, London. Yeah. I suppose that's it, isn't it? Is that, um... Descent to flight level 300. Is that the, uh... The more precise one makes the instruction. As in, one... The more precise one makes the, uh, required input. The less, um... The bot itself has to do, it, uh... Get into sort of who oh, blimey. I will. Um, yes, that if you as soon as you make it more sort of um, idiot proof, uh, the more difficult it is to to keep it on the straight and narrow. Is it medicines? Should be medicines, shouldn't it? Ooh. Or is it not? Salvage. Ooh, look at those. Good grief. <laughs> Them curtains going all in for breakage. <laughs> Burkhardt's uh, worried that Jean Malone might be expecting payment. We have a, a miss, I think. Yes, I've, uh, yes, I'm very much mistaken. Hang about. Oh, let me just double check that the error is not um, 
what's that phrase? Uh, Pebcac, yeah, Pebcac. Problem exists between keyboard and chair. Yeah, performance enhancers. Copy nook. Mm -hmm. So, Packard. Um, I suppose that's problematic, not um, not just in terms of it being erroneous, but where the error lies in the information that the data bit, that the bot is running from, rather than the the bot misinterpreting the data itself if that makes sense let's um let's give that a whirl actually hang on I say. Hmm. Ah, book out is checked. Probably out of stock. It relies on EDB potato, which is always hit or miss. Yeah, mm, I, I, I thought that might be the case. Mm. So, um, ah, good thinking. Girlfriend lab. It's running old data right now, but it will be using up to date data soon, dear. Right, Spurcat. And was that? Because I think we did we did discuss this briefly at um, at Livecon, but uh, a plan to uh, to hook it up to commander logs for. Or was that my imagination? In fact, the last price update for Bondar platform is 10 days old. Ooh, blame, blame me. And it's quite a lucrative, um, lucrative mission nearby as well, so. Burkett says it will listen to EDDN, which does receive commander logs. Nice. No, I've got more. I've got some lovely weapons here. Hang on. Oh, yes. So we had rail guns and all sorts. Plasma and rail we had before, which uh, was a nice idea, but really beyond me momentarily. So uh, let's see what the gimp's done. Oh, he's, he's popped in some. Uh, must be scanners. Let's give me a couple of beams, a couple of multi cannons. Ooh, turreted cannons. That should be fun. Chaff launch and electronic countermeasure. Mm. Lovely. 
Right. But, uh, enough blind driving. Here we are. Yeah, I guess I should add it to say both the current and the closest, excluding the current, rather than just the current at zero light years. That's a thing, isn't it? It's like, you know. You often have to let it into the wild a little to, to see what people what people's sort of intuitive expectations are of it. Which I'm sure, you know. There's no news to perk at. <laughs> What would streaming be if it didn't involve me thinking out loud? <laughs> so have we, we've had a lot of sun in the United Kingdom. Uh, just wondering if our British shams made full use of it this weekend. Managed to catch up on my laundry, which is miraculous. Oop, coming in a little, a little fast. Orbital flight engaged. Girlfriend lap. Oh yes, the Shrike, I've caught the sun. I booped, I booped the sun my own little way. <laughs> thank you, thank you, M. Curtains. It is a nice potato. Right then, to have a closer look at that um, planet we started out on. Uh, the Gilfand update was three days old. I should have mentioned that. <laughs> that's um, uh, that's possibly something else one could report to the user, I suppose. Um, make up some sort of I wonder if one could calculate some sort of um, confidence uh, metric you know depending on what the commodity is and how old the data is I suppose that would take more Good stuff. Uh, M. Curtains, we walked around a local springs nature reserve. It was surprisingly cool in the shade. I should probably request docking, shouldn't I? When I'm still allowed. Landing permitted. Set down on landing pad 06. Shouldn't take long, Percat. I described it in a sentence. <laughs> it's a little joke there. <clears throat> well, oh, good night, Jean Bellow. And thank you for thank you for dropping by and trying to break things. Your efforts are welcome. <laughs> Uh, 
No, no dice. Hmm. No, I do want a um. I do want a, a positive. Tempted to blow off the, uh, hmm. You see, I could, I could blow off this mission and pick another one, is what I'm thinking. I don't even have to blow it off, really, do I? I could just, I could just pick another one. It's not your fault, Perkat. It's the data. It's the data. Gigo, as the as the saying goes. Not that it's you know. Yeah. Right. Ah, oh, let's see how we do. Sun. No, let's let's not do that. Let's uh, let's carry on as we were. Yes. Ooh. We're reaching that time of year where the sun goes down during the stream. So uh, that's why it looks like I'm shooting the stream from under Maduve with a torch. I think we're on our final stream on this battery as well before uh, before the recharge. So if the lights go out, you'll know why. My internet is pooping out, and the weekend is ending. I bid you all good night and safe travels, Commander Little. Uh, thank you for thank you for dropping in, uh, Perkhead. I'm sorry we didn't get a um, fully successful run, but. Uh, I think the concept's there, and I have it on good authority that um, when the data is right, the uh, the outcome is right. Safe travels, that that and I will uh, hopefully do you proud before I have to turn on myself. Make your way to landing pad four, five. 
Here we are, 45. Have a look at Sawahin. If that's local. Oh, oh spelling spelled correctly. I think. Uh, yeah. Oh, bit of a bit of a lick. Oh no, not tonight then. Right now. Oh, now currently we are. Um, Highlighting boom systems. So let's let's fire up another boom. There we are. Let's see if we can't get one licked before before the end of play. Smooth aggress. Lovely. Do you like a fly past? Oh. What, what, what? Commodity bot fund. <laughs> Thank you for your tips, MC. I have to give 10% uh, to Percat. <laughs> Maybe ninety percent. I'm not sure. I'm not sure who's the uh, who's the agent in this scenario. Dig there. Well, I've, I've not done me. Uh, hang on. Let's see if I've got it in me. Now it's carry ground. Unit. Unit. Mm. Hmm. Mm, Betty, no, that's that's not it at all, is it? That's Frank Spencer. Uh, come on, I've got it. I've got it. I, I had it earlier. Hmm. I'd like I'd like to send a letter, please. Oh, that's better. Yes. I would like a book of six first-class stamps. I wish to send an epistle to my ingenue. There's some good words. Don't know what they meant. They, they, they were good, weren't they? My protege is boarding at Claridge's. Oh, good lord. And I feel he's in moral danger. Whew. They're selling his stamps then, I reckon. I would send him an email, but I have forgotten my AOL password. Oh, see that little, little sort of, mm, little run up he has to the plosives there. Lovely, lovely stuff. Whew. I think the, the trouble I was having is it is that you can start here, but you can sort you can sort of take it up here a little bit. And you, no, no, that didn't work at all. Hang on. You know I will. Oh. 
Split personality? Shrek? No. No. Just, um, mildly dissociative. <laughs> You've got switch face. Ugh. Ooh, blimey. Oh, that was nearly an embarrassment. Ooh, wowzers, trousers, what a view. What a view, eh? Very possibly Jamaican accent, yes. Blake on. Juliet Alpha Charlie. This port operates under federal jurisdiction. You must submit a request before landing. I tend to think of voices as occupying a certain place within my skull. So, this one, for instance, sits just sort of somewhere between my nose and the back of my throat. Yes. It doesn't account for the whole of the voice, of course. One has to consider words and uh, what one wishes to do with one's teeth, down lips. One. It does not fit me, no. It's because it's not my voice. This is my voice, yes. My perfectly normal, real voice. Ooh, steady. Someone's in a hurry. Oh. You know, you've got to play around with voices, haven't you? It's the best instrument one has. One's own voice. Oh. Them cuts, right? So I think a Jack Little impersonation. Impression act. Solid contact. Dispatching ground crew. Station facilities are at your disposal, Commander. Go down well. Go, would go down well on stars in their eyes. Or whatever today's equivalent is. I shan't, I shan't assign you all with voices. I think that might be going... Well, maybe I should. Maybe I should. Maybe when I get my, you know, 200th follower or something. <laughs> I never feels good to have a fish in your mouth. In your throth. 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 Is that a... Is that a... Oh, I forgot, I've forgotten where I am now. Hang on. <clears throat> is that a... Um, that's better. Hello and welcome. Um, yes, that's me. That's definitely me. I never feels good to have a fish in your throat. Is that a... Um, is that a Dutch saying, Shrek? Strot. Strot. I wonder what that means. Frothing at the troth. Froth. Whoa. Whose rear art works again? Who? Who dear? Ooh, there we go. Copper. That's a safer bet, isn't it? Yeah, let's let's do copper. Get the pestle to the metal. It's the Dutch word for throth. But I have no clue how to write it in English. It's throat. Throat. Uh, T-H-R-O-A-T. Yes. I think it's throat, but um, we have obviously the word mouth, you see, and I was wondering if you're having a stab at both of them at the same time. Uh, I sometimes do that in speech. I have a tendency to um, try and say two words simultaneously. Um, yes. So we are in... Hang on. Oh, here we are. Yeah, the land two two seven oh one. L A L A N D E. Oh, it's gone again. Uh, two two seven oh one. There we go. It's still on the screen. And we change you, young man, to copper. Yes. Oh, you like that? He 
He's having a think. Oh, it's not really a smooth. It's, it's almost like an accidental uh, portmanteau. Ah, uh, M curtains. Yes. My records can this is The Nagi Bowl system. Gordon Hagger. Oh, there's a couple of those. There we go. Okay, right. Let's try that out then. This is a big old system. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's another thing as well. Oh, no, it just rounds up every time. I think that's what that is. Oh. So I think we're going to run a little over. But I think it's going to be worth it in the end. You see how graceful this, this works? Detach confirmed. Regulate speed until outside the exclusion zone. Exclusion zone? Something from the imagination of Tarkovsky. Yeah. Oh, I'm falling in love with the planets again, you know. I think partly because I've been playing um, No Man's Sky uh, off stream a little. And um, I do like to chill out with ooh, shadows. Shadows on me lung. Oh, I do like, I do like to chill out with uh, NMS from time to time, and also I wanted to, uh, I want to get a little sort of uh, cash factory running, up and running, um, ahead of the update which is coming in July. Um, and much as I like the art style. Much as I like the art style, I um, uh, I do find their planets rather ridiculous in terms of uh, look and feel. They look okay from a certain distance, but uh, as one approaches, they, they sort of the sense of realism rather falls apart. I know that's sort of partly to, to prop up the, not prop up, that's slightly too negative, to uh, support, that's better, the uh, the art style, really. And of course the, uh, the fact that, oh, the fact that it's all procedurally generated, um, you know, from a sort of single, as I understand it, from a single formula. much more um, profound way than uh, Elite Dangerous is. Elite Dangerous has a sort of a very realist rule set and uh, um, sort of, uh, it's hard to explain really. One feels anyway that it's sort of It's uh, sort of a constructionist uh, notion, you know. Whereas with uh, NMS, one feels it's, you know, one feels as if the developer has said, right, these are the numbers, what can we do with these numbers? Elite is more like, okay. We know that such and such a planet is such and such a distance from the sun. Shame indeed, M. Kurtz. Although apparently this is still faster. Confirmed. Docking request granted. I, mean, I thought 
was going to get a denial. Just, just a little flicker of doubt in my mind. Oh, nope, here we are. Permitted. A nimble asp, it may be faster in a sluggish type 10, it probably isn't. Was there, are there really different handling um, models? Uh, I suppose there must be, mustn't there? Because that's the uh, that's the issue with um, uh, interdiction, isn't it? So yes, I suppose I suppose there must be. Thank you for that reminder, Wolfwind 36. Asp does indeed have landing gear. Yes. So easy to forget, isn't it? Because, you know, out of sight, out of mind, that's what I say. I think what we'll do is we'll. we'll oh, blow me tight. This is not anyone's night, is it? I think I'm afraid that on that on that down ending, I think we should consider this uh, very much the Empire Strikes Back of uh, the. Uh, uh, I know, I know, Wolfen. It's crazy. There's um, war everywhere. But yes, on that on that down note, I think I'm going to have to. I'm afraid. Uh, call it quits for the evening. Uh, as you know, we generally we generally stream for a. Hour uh, here, so uh, our hour is up, uh, which is a shame because uh, I had hoped to uh, show off this bot in all its finery. But obviously, with issues with data and whatnot, that's not going to happen. Um, so, what should we do? We should find someone to. Raid. Who should we raid? Hmm. Let us raid. Let us raid. It's between Collo and Honey Thief. We did Honey Thief last time, so I think it's going to have to be Collo. Uh, so let's do that. I'm just going to type in the uh, command. I know she's not playing ED, but, uh, you know, it's all about family, isn't it? It's all about your family. Family. Yeah. It's all about the family. <coughs> <coughs> so, right. Thanks for the stream and pro-level bot advert. It was pro-level, wasn't it? Wasn't it? I think we broke it in interesting ways. We hit, ag hit against walls that are useful. Useful walls that we hit. Ah, oh, yes. So, anyway. Enough of this shilly shallying. Uh, I'd just like to thank. Oh. Oh. Well, bang goes that raid. <laughs> oh, well. Hello, 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 hello. Nothing happened. No, Olok did not rise. Oh. Thank you so much, um, uh, Colo. And unfortunately, we're about to um, uh, we're about to turn in for the for the night for the evening, and I was literally uh, literally just um, just about to raid you, so uh, you've rather beat me to the uh, beat me to the chase there. Uh, so I suppose I suppose we're in a bit of a raid chain here, and it's going to have to be, uh, comply with the shrike's demands. Pass you all on to the honey thief, I'm afraid. But before I do that, I'm going to needlessly thank everyone uh, for joining me. Uh, ce soir. Uh, so yes, I'd like to thank. Um, I'd like to thank Shrikey. Um, who <laughs> M curtains for doing that. Uh, uh, 
I mean, they just go through all of them because there's some bots in here and I can't, I can't fathom them. Uh, Commander Root, keep to heal, girl. Uh, head commodity bot. Where would we be without head commodity bot tonight? <laughs> uh, electrical skateboard, he's not real. Hello, it's Colo. Uh, uh, Millstone Barn, Wolf in 36. Zerx 80. Uh, who else did we have? We had Jean Below as well. And, um, and yes, I think that's. It's a lot of it. Uh, who else? Who else did we have briefly? Thomas, Sparrow Black, Moosey Pan, JJ Smashing Pumpkins, Caramba, Caramba, dear, dear friend. Sparrow Black, uh, Thomas again. Ooh, all the, all the head ones are here. And, uh, yes. So, without further ado, oh, and there's one more person I need to thank, of course, and that's Steve Kirby for making me the man I am today. Yes. So until we meet again, fly safe, fly sharp, <laughs> just throw that one in because I'm not ready, and I shall see you in the black. I forgot to press return. Yes, indeed. Jack Little raid phrases. Jack Little raid phrases, as we know. Good luck. <laughs>